Hello, today for sample of the week, we are looking at a Wurlitzer. And what I love about this, I think my favorite thing so far, is the actual UI. It's absolutely drop dead gorgeous. And all these little things you can see on the screen, all these little knobs, you can actually move around, they do different things. And what's so great about this instrument is you can go from this very simple sound to something very complex and ambient or bring it right back to something a bit more plucky, some, something a bit more short, more traditional of a Wurlitzer. He has really gone all the way and he's got a number of different presets. Uh, he's got a load of extra little knobs in there as well. Uh, it's really creative. It's really fun. He's obviously gone in and updated it as well as we go. And I, if I'm honest, well, look at the reviews that should tell you alone how fantastic this is and to think this is free completely decent samplers free to download which is the plugin you stick it in to make it work and this in itself is free and available on piano book created by daniel rosenholm i'm probably butchering that name sounds german uh, cool guy um read at your own leisure basically he's created multiple different layers of this and he's got some original things in there a wobble and a granular which is great for textural sort of things so have a mess around it's one of those things when you go in there press a couple notes mess around with the ui and see what happens and he's also assigned things to cc's i'll let you read that i'm more of a guy who likes to jump in and see what happens so let's move over to logic pro x uh, and a decent sampler and as i said look at this ui absolutely gorgeous each knob does something you just drag it and literally everything on here has a purpose and it's so cool and so well done um, but without further ado let's just go in there start editing the sound having a bit of fun we've loaded the first one as you'll probably see there actually there is six different patches he has made but of course you can go in there and edit it yourself so we'll load the original play a couple notes and we'll start messing around with what these knobs do. Let's see if the mod wheel does anything as well. Oh, that's your filter. Of course your pedal does something as well. And that's a very simple, very plucky sound. Watch what happens when we instantly start adding things. Reverb, we can also increase the size on that. I love the panning on this. And now here's the funky stuff, a bit of granular. Velocity sensitive, which I always love. Vibrato. Increase the red. Auto well. So you can go from a very simple sound, as I said, to a very nice, complex, almost ambient sound. Add a little bit of granular to add some texture. We can also affect the attack, the release, and other bits over here. Ooh, let's say ET. I can't see what that says, but it does something cool. Keys. I think that could be the pedal. Oh, that's the release, I think. So cool. Let's have a look at another one. Wobletizer. Ooh, and, oh, different UIs. I love the stereo effect on this one. I feel like I'm in the middle. And of course you can do all the same things as well.
very sci-fi. Explore another one, Grand Letizer. Nice for background textures there. What else has he got? Toy Nizer. Not my favorite, but I can kind of see what he's going for. I, I, I love the UIs, they're so cute. Uh, Dreamanizer. All very unique sounds, each one of these. And the final one, a Funkatizer. <laughs> a lot of fun. I, 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 just the UIs keep getting me here. And of course you can edit it. I think they're all the same. They're just um, different versions of them within it. So presets basically, so you don't have to create them yourself. So you can see how many unique sounds you can already build from this. And again, I keep saying this, but it's free. Uh, and messing around with it is really worthwhile because you can create some really unique and beautiful sounds um, from this recording. It's quite big, it's nearly a gigabyte. So there's lots of samples there, lots to mess around with. Definitely worth going in and having a bit of fun. So 100% go and check out this arm piano book. It's by Daniel Rosenholm. It is called The Wurlitzer with a cool little O. Check it out. Have some fun with it. This has been Sample of the Week. I hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.